Wow, they just hung up. Yep, they did just hang up. Let's give this another go. Unbelievable. <laughs> That's for help with tax. <laughs> Does that mean there's no help with tax? We're helpless? Welcome to the Cater's office. We are open Monday to Friday. I'll just press naught. See if this trick works. Hello? Welcome to the adjudicator's office. No, it doesn't work. We are open Monday to Friday between 9am and 5... That does work. 9999. Nine, nine, nine. Oh, sorry, who's that speaking? Andrea, hiya. All right, I'm sorry to chop you there. Yeah, I, I'm thinking of making a complaint, but I just wanted to run something by you to make sure I'm not going to waste your time or my time. Is that all right? I'll find it, no problem. Right, OK. Um, now, I'm, it, it, it's recently come to my attention that there's no actual law obliging people to pay any tax whatsoever. So I'm actually looking to have all of my tax reimbursed to me because I, I, I don't agree with how it's been used. Um, you know, unless of course you agree with blowing people up and stuff like that. Um, but I don't agree with that. So I'm looking to actually claw back all of my tax. And I don't know whether you have experts on site or whether you're kind of like an expert, but I just wanted to double check. Um, as I say, I, I'm, I'm, I'm planning to do this or thinking of doing this based on the fact that there's no law obliging people to pay tax. So can I just ask, as far as you're aware, have you actually seen, you know, have you, do, you, do you know of a law that obliges people to pay tax? I've never heard of anybody wanting to claim it all back. No? Um, oh, right. What I'm going to try to do, Bob, well, before you can actually come to the adjudicator's office, yeah. we've gone through an HMRC's own internal complaints procedure first. So I just have to go through, so it's just like the financial yeah. ombudsman service then in some respects, yeah? What was that? I was saying it's just like with the with the money. If you issue a complaint with your bank, is that right? You have to go through the bank first, then to the then to yourself, like the ombudsman, yeah. Yeah, well, the ombudsman's the last place you can go to. Um, obviously, the first first thing you need to do is go back to HMRC. Yeah. Tell them I don't know what you want to say to me that you want to claim back all your tax. Yeah. Yeah, get two chance to complain with them first. Yeah. Right, so it's HMRC first, yeah. then then it's you guys, and then it's the ombudsman, yeah? Yeah. Right. And is there a, a particular time I've got to get this all completed in from big when from when I first complain? Well once you've received your final letter from HMRC, yeah. Obviously. And is there a time period that I've got to refer it to you within? It's within six months of receiving your final letter. Right. Gotcha. So it's just right. Gotcha. And if and if and have they got a certain period of time they've got to resolve the complaint in? It depends how complex your case is. All oh, right. So there's no dead set. Depends on how, yeah, but they have got right. a lot of complaints on hand. It depends on. Gotcha. And just that, just. Someone that they look into and everything. Yeah. So just out of interest. What happens if I can't get a final letter from HMRC? What if they refuse to type one up? Does that mean I can't refer it to you? Well, they shouldn't refuse. Um, I mean, if you mark your complaint, formal complaint, Yeah. Um, they do have a You just have to look at the proper complaint and get your chance to complain with them. Yeah, sure. So, but just, just in case that did happen, let's pretend that someone there got really funny with me and they all refused to issue a final letter, a final response letter. Can I then just refer it to you guys or not? Well, what you could do, you could always go to MP and ask them to look at it on your behalf. Right, so in other words, I need a letter with, and does it actually have to say final response or? Yeah, well, it normally says, if you remain unhappy, you can have to complete the adjudicator's office. That's the letter that we would need from you first. So they need, ah, so it's got to have the referral option on there for yeah. the adjudicators. Gotcha. And then I've got six months from when I get that letter, yeah? Yeah. Okay, no, that's brilliant stuff. And you guys also handle complaints about the insolvency service, yeah? Brilliant. Lovely. Okay, I really appreciate your time. Bye. Thanks then. Bye. Bye. Right, okay. <laughs> Guess what I'm going to be doing next.